Governor Abu Kefas of Taraba State says his administration will probe the saboteurs responsible for the liquidation of some profitable government companies in the state. Speaking during an inspection of some ongoing projects, the governor insisted that anyone found culpable in the vandalization of the greenhouse facilities would be made to pay for it. Olabi Adenosi compiled this report. Taraba State's greenhouse project is cited between the State University and the State College of Agriculture, Science and Technology, Jalingo. It's one of the Maribond companies owned by the state government and was established by the previous administration. The companies that gulped over 2 billion naira are now laying fallow. But reviving these Maribond companies to boost the eternally generated revenue of the state is the reason for this unscheduled visit by Governor Agbu Kefas. Speaking during an assessment tour, Governor Kefas insisted that the project has a positive prospect. He also talked about his resolve to investigate what led to the collapse of the facilities and avert a reoccurrence. The project is a very good project. It has prospects. And I think uh, they started very well. But along the line, they have some challenges, which uh, is best not to them. We are still going to... Uh, look at them to find out what led to the collapse of this place so that uh, we we'll avoid such uh, mistakes. The governor assures that anyone found culpable in the vandalization of the facilities will be made to pay, no matter their position in the society. However, Governor Kefas is optimistic that the revival of the facilities will be actualized. Of this is, is criminal, so we're going to set up an investigation into it to know those that were involved in the vandalization. Governor Kefas gave reasons for the transformation of the greenhouse as he plans to use the revenue generated to fund education in the states.